Kevin Young is back home. So too Andrew McCutcheon. He's back in Pittsburgh. And Zach Grinke, who was drafted by the Royals, he's back and he's pitching tonight. As for the Royals, that two and seven road trip of the seven losses, six of them were decided by two runs or less. So a lot of losses again, but some competitive baseball. As Zach Grinke returns to the mound tonight. Start number 23, appearance number 24. But he's fun to watch because he pitches to contact. And oh, by the way, he can field his position. He's plus seven in defensive run save. Best fielding pitcher in baseball. How about a base hit maybe up the middle? Diving try, but no chance to get the speedy base. So a leadoff hit. Yeah, it's just what the Pirates ordered. It's going to be a tough play for Bobby Witt Jr. As athletic as he is, speedy Bay. Not getting out the box, especially when you smell that hit. Mm -hmm. See the smell in the barbecue or smell in yeah. the hit? <laughs> oh, two up the middle. Base hit. Bay will hold at second as Isbell getting to that ball quickly in its first and second. Well, a rare 0 2 mistake right there. Veteran Andrew McCutcheon. McCutcheon hitting 252 with 93 hits and a dozen home runs. Chance for two. Witt to second for one. The first and got him both. A huge double play. That turns the inning around and McCutcheon grounding into the double play. Witt to Massey to Beatty. So runner at third, two out. Palacios, the Pirates left fielder to the plate. Now a bouncing ball to first. That's a fair ball. And Beatty steps on first. Zach works around the back to back singles to begin the game. Right hander Johan Oviedo. Oviedo on the season. He's got a 4 4 6 ERA. It's 7 13 record. 145 at a third innings, 131 hits. And 129 strikeouts. And Melendez is retired, so up comes Bobby Witt. <laughs> there you go. Good walk there. Coming back from 0 and 2. Let's have a runner with one out. So now Perez and Salvi with 19 home runs, 112 hits. Fly ball. Left center field. You've got a couple of guys that uh, really aren't used to playing defense next to each other all that much in Palacios and Bay, but Palacios makes the catch for the second out. And a pop up, Malika Williams. That's more like it for Oviedo. He did walk wit, but puts up a zero, and it's nothing, nothing after one. Nothing, nothing to any number two, and Indy Rodriguez will be the first up for the Pirates against Grinky. That snaps an off for 12 hitless string. A line single to center field. That is the prescription so far for the Pirates against Grinky is whack it up the middle. Yeah, you see a common theme there. You see this pitch was elevated a little bit. Obviously, thigh high, outstretched glove of Bobby Witt Jr. So Winsky is on. Pagero draws a walk. And the bases are loaded with nobody out. Now Alfonso Rivas. Rivas hits it on the ground to second, on the short, and back to first for a double play. No run batted in as Rodriguez scores. So Winsky takes third. It's a double play ball, but the Pirates take a one nothing lead. You know, anytime you can get two for one, especially this early in the game, and even if you're giving, giving up a, a run, you're going to take that all day long. So Grinky flirting with disaster and, and able to navigate it a little bit. Jiwon Bay leads it off for the Pirates here in the third inning. Down the left field line, tailing away from Melendez. It's down for a hit. Bay will turn the bag and head for second base, and he's already in there. He is two for two, opposite field double. Pirates with the leadoff hit in every inning against Granke. Jiwon Bay going the other way. Gets those hands in there really nice and drops it right in there. And with this speed, it's very easily a double. Round ball, that's fair. That'll give the Pirates a 2 nothing lead. Bay will score easily. Around first, Hayes heads to second. Hayes thought about third. He's got a ripping RBI double. Back to back, two baggers for the Bucks. They're up 2 nothing in Kansas City. And he just continues to rake. Big RBI opportunities that continue to grow as his RBI total continues to increase. That's 50 RBIs now on the year for him. So two up, two down in the fifth inning. And here's Key Brian Hayes. He's been on both times. He's been up there a single and a double and an RBI tonight. And there's another hit for him. He's three for three. Wow. We'll have to update those August numbers for Key Brian Hayes. I tell you what, that is the one ball that Zach Grinke is very fortunate. Yeah. Look at this. That's a gold glover that <laughs> yeah. has a good good finish and everything else. That ball was smoked up the middle. And that's going to be the last batter Zach faces. Grinke done for the night. And off he comes. And as you'd expect, Zach getting a nice hand from the home folks. MJ Melendez draws a one out walk. He's on base for the second time tonight. And that brings up Bobby Wood Jr. Ground ball. Oh, what a stop by Hayes. They get one. They'll never get two. But what a play by Key Brian Hayes. 
tremendous play. Backhand play. Look at that first step in between hops. Ooh. Backhand side. And then throw the money right on the money to Figueroa. E. Brian Hayes was all over that. Did he go? He did. Oviedo strikes out Perez and gets out of it. Seventh inning coming up. Alfonso Rivas to start a lefty batter. Career 130 hitter against lefties. And going the other way, and that ball is going to drop in and bounce away from Melendez. And Rivas will Rivas will hold it second with leadoff double as Melendez almost played that into a triple. Yeah, very unique. You see a, a pitch up out over the plate, hit that ball in that corner, and it just rolls around the side of that wall. And to Beatty, who goes to third, and the Royals get the out. It was very close, but Rivas is walking off the field. He thinks he's out. That's exactly what Beatty wanted to do. He crashed, and he came in, and a butt came right to him. <laughs> Anytime he hits it, it is coming off hard, just he's like four this. Four for four. <laughs> Brian Hayes is four for four. First and second, two outs, and McCutcheon coming up. Andrew McCutcheon facing Taylor Hearn. And a shot, whoa! Ducking out of the way, Alika Williams, he will score. That ball was ripped by Andrew McCutcheon. The RBI makes it 3 0. So runners on the corners now with two outs for Joshua Palacios. This ball bounced toward the first baseman, and that's going to be an RBI infield hit for Palacios as Beatty looked around. Hearn was not there, and the Pirates take a 4 0 lead. Leadoff single. Jack Back on base twice today. Alfonso Rivas. Home plate. Wow, the other way again for Rivas. Rivas going to get Sawinski home. He'll score with really out much of a play. And Rivas, a wide turn at second. He will be out there. And uh, the Pirates uh, will get an RBI double. Pirates have made it 5 to nothing. 25 year old right hander, Johan Oviedo. Talk about this horse. Oviedo rolling right along here in Kansas City. Got the full arsenal working tonight. Eight scoreless innings for Johan Oviedo. Now he has an opportunity to do something he's never done before in a major league uniform. Oviedo and out away from a two hit shutout in Kansas City. Salvador Perez stands in the way. Swinging a bouncer on to third. Hayes gloves it. The toss across. He got him. He's thrown a complete game. Two hit shutout in Kansas City.